Hey Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. So today I have a collective message. We're going to find out what we want you to hear. Please remember this minute resonate for every Sagittarius. This also could resonate for your Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. And this is timeless. So let's get straight into this Sagittarius and find out what we want you to hear. Okay, Sagittarius. I'm getting this energy where you are somebody that is very sensitive, very kind, very caring, and then you have this very good balance of also being somebody that is very in control, okay, very focused on yourself. I am getting that you put time and energy into yourself, okay, into your goals, um, into your body, right, I do see that you're also very focused on your career and your money, right, and I'm getting that you have a lot going for you, right, you have a lot, you're very emotionally stable as well and also very financially stable, right, and you seem to have a lot going for you at the moment. But I am getting that. It feels like you're attracting people that are not, not on your vibration. Not in the same energy as you. Right? There's two people in particular here in your energy. Right? These two people want a chance with you. Like I do see that. You definitely have an option here between two people, right? One of them is, um, they're a little bit reckless, okay? A little bit immature. Um, they definitely don't always tell the truth. They definitely don't see the value in telling the truth. Um, they're also somebody that, they're very extreme with their emotion, okay, they're not very stable, they don't like routine, right, they're not somebody that usually commits either, they're somebody that had an issue with commitment, this is somebody that they feel more like a player energy, okay, Sagittarius, they feel like somebody that they're not 100% serious, um, there's a lot of sexual energy, but they are not serious about committing, right? I'm also getting that there's this energy where they don't really resonate with you on an intellectual level at all. Like you try to, if you try to have some type of like deep and meaningful conversation with them, they will not understand you. Like they literally, they're not that type of person. Okay, you cannot have that type of energy with this person. They're more of a very, they're very vague, okay? They don't really go deep into things, okay? They kind of just go with the flow. This person doesn't really feel comfortable with themselves and their own personality. It feels like they kind of latch onto other people. Um, they follow the crowd. Um, there's also an unreliable energy to this person, like... It just feels like you guys don't, you're not on the same vibration, okay? This person could be a Scorpio or a Cancer. There's also somebody else in your energy as well. Now, this person, they feel like they don't really have a lot of ambition. When you have a lot of ambition, they're not somebody that, 
they're not as grounded as you either. They tend to... I'm getting that you guys do get along, okay, but I'm also getting that if you see somebody that, again, they're not really on your level um, financially, okay, they're not somebody that's independent, they, I'm kind of getting this person, they need help, okay, they may live with other people or I'm just getting they're not as financially independent as you okay and they're not as independent in general as you um this person is a very dependent energy and they may try to depend on you right i am getting that again for some of you Things seem to be moving quick, right? You seem to be getting a lot of opportunities, a lot of options are here. Um, but these options, I'm getting that you're not satisfied with them on a soul level, on a spiritual level, even on an emotional level. Like I'm just getting that, yeah, like there are two people here. But again, both of them don't really meet up to your expectations, to be honest, right? Like, it really feels like you would have to put a lot of energy time into both of these people. A lot of work into these people, okay? It feels like that... It really feels like that you would have to like train them or something right or you'd have to like put up with issues here okay you are somebody that is very healed Sagittarius right you are somebody that especially spiritually like I'm just getting that you continuously work on yourself um you have a different viewpoint when it comes to love, like, you are looking for unconditional love. You're looking for a soul connection, right? But I do say that these options are here that you don't really feel a soul connection with, right? These people don't really resonate with you on even an intellectual level, but especially a spiritual level. I'm getting this energy where you feel like you would have to, like, dumb yourself down. To even fit in with these people, right? Could be dealing with an Aquarius or a Pisces. You are somebody that, again, your spirituality is very important to you. I am getting that you are somebody that is very magical. You are, you manifest, okay? But I'm getting that people don't understand that. I'm getting that you have really reached a point in your spiritual journey where you are actually finding it very hard to resonate with people around you, right? Not just romantic partners, friends, family members, okay? You may be feeling very alone at the moment. You may also feel like that you will need to, you want somebody that is like willing to, even if they're not as spiritual, you know, you need somebody that is willing to understand you on a spiritual level, willing to open up on a spiritual level where you, like I'm getting that you don't mind healing somebody, teaching somebody. But it's like you need this person to be open to it. And I'm getting that the people that you're coming across, they're not really getting it, right? Again, you may be feeling very isolated at the moment, very alone. And again, there's like people around you, but they don't really understand you on a soul level. It's like they don't get it. For some of you, um, 
you've done a lot of healing, as I mentioned, right? You've done a lot of healing and you've upgraded so much, right? You've also lost people in the process. Um, but then also, even if you haven't really lost them, there's been this realisation, right? That you don't really connect with people around you like that anymore, right? And that's just a part of the process, okay? I am getting that you are very aware of the pain that people are going through. And I do see that a lot of people around you, they tend to live in the past and they tend to hold on to, like, old pain, okay? Like, old issues. Um, then issues with people wanting to evolve, right? And because you have chosen to evolve, it's like you're not really connecting with those people that haven't evolved, okay? Yeah, I'm just getting that you feel alone, you feel isolated, even with your friends, okay? It's just like you guys don't... There's nothing in common, right? For some of you, you actually prefer to be alone at the moment. But I do see that even the love often, right? It just, it doesn't feel, it just doesn't feel right on a soul level. For some of you, you've had a spiritual awakening. You've met some type of divine counterpart that really opened up your heart chakra. And I'm getting that you experienced some type of unconditional love that it's kind of hard to settle for anything less, right? Because the people, even these love often, it's like conditional love, right? It's like, and again, you don't seem to resonate with these people on a soul level and that is very important to you. I'm getting that whoever I'm picking up on, you're going through, there's a divine counterpart here, right? Like some type of twin flame journey, okay? Whatever you want to label it, but there's some type of significant soul connection that has really opened up your eyes, opened up your heart, okay? Made you feel a way that you've never felt before and it's been very healing, it's also made you grow spiritually and I do see that you have made up your mind that that's the type of connection that you want in your life now it doesn't have to be with the divine counterpart but you are looking for a soul connection right somebody that really understands you you could be manifesting that right and I do see you being very successful with that but I do see that you have a lot of people that want to be with you. Like, it feels like people would... You have options here. Like, you've got people that would fight over you, like, or are fighting to be with you, or... There's just a lot of conflict here, right? But you are very selective, right? You don't really care about who wants you. You want somebody that you resonate with right, that you have a true connection with, that you have an intellectual connection with, a soul connection with, somebody that you can really build with, right? I'm getting that you're very attractive, very attractive, um, and I'm getting that you also spend a lot of time alone, Sagittarius, and people are very, like, they wonder why you're always alone, because they feel like, you should be around people because you're so attractive, right? But I'm getting that, again, you would prefer to be around quality people, okay? And spend quality time together, right? Like, I'm getting that you don't surround yourself with people that you don't resonate with and you would prefer to be alone. Like, you are so okay with being alone and spending time with yourself like I'm just getting that you really like love your own energy love yourself like you realize that 
you have you like you literally have your own back right and you are okay with being alone people are very shocked because especially people that are not used to being alone um they don't really want to be alone they're scared to be alone um people are very shocked at how comfortable you are being alone and they don't understand why but again you like that like you prefer quality over quantity that's all i have for you sagittarius if it resonated let me know don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video